Busy Mom Solutions, presented by Ingalls. Hello, I'm Jasmine Queen with the Ingalls Table, and today we are making famous burger casserole. That's right, you heard me, famous burger casserole. So I have some ground beef, I've already browned that, and now I'm gonna put in some of this pre-diced onion that I got from Ingalls. I'm using a white onion today. And you know what, we're gonna dump all of this in. There we go. And you want to stir that up and get it all mixed in. And this is such an easy dinner, y'all. You can have this on a weeknight. If you have places to be, this does not take long at all to throw together, which you guys know those are my favorite kind of meals, right? And now we're gonna take some dill relish and we're gonna dump that in here. And y'all, I love dill relish, so if you wanna add more, you certainly can. It will still be probably even better if you add a little bit more. Okay, and then we have a casserole dish and we're just gonna dump this in our casserole dish. A little bit closer, there we go. It's a lot of hamburger. This will feed quite a few people, guys. Then when we get in the casserole, you wanna flatten it out. And you can make this ahead of time. You can make it for one day and then eat it for dinner the next, all right. And now we just have some sliced cheese. And obviously, the more cheese, the better, right? So we're gonna layer this on, and we're just kind of making like a little hamburger out of it. There we go, and if you wanna use more cheese than me, certainly feel free to go right ahead and do that. Okay, and now for our topping. We are gonna use crescent rolls. If you wanted to, you could even use hamburger buns for this. That would also be extra tasty, but we're gonna do crescent rolls today. You just kinda take them out of their package, and then we're gonna take, I don't know, we'll take about half at a time. Then you just lay it on here and unroll it, and then just layer that on top of your cheese here. And they don't have to be pushed together. There we go, kind of go out like that. And then we'll do this half. There we go. And this is kind of sticking together and that's okay, because again, it does not have to be perfect. Ah, oh, this one's coming out a little bit easier. So roll it out. There we go. And then we'll do the same for this one. All right, I'm gonna pull this over a little bit. They don't necessarily, you don't have to press the seams together on this because it's gonna bake up quite pretty, but you can kind of push it out just a little bit so every piece has a little bit of crescent roll there on top. And then when we get done, let me show you what it looks like. When we get done, you have this absolutely delicious casserole and we are gonna to top it with a little bit of shredded lettuce. There we go. Some tomato. Looking good. And then to top it off, we are gonna use some Thousand Island dressing. Drizzle that on the top here. And you have a quick, easy, absolutely delicious, famous burger casserole. Ingles and Busy Mom Solutions, we're with you every step of the way. Busy Mom Solutions, presented by Ingles. For the full recipe and shopping list, head over to WSPA.com and click on Busy Mom Solutions under the Community tab.